today. This is Jordan from the board, movement specialist. I'm just here to show you guys a few simple movements that you should do every day of your life to keep your spine mobile and young and alive. Um, first, my favorite movement, hanging. So you wanna find something to hang from? Pardon our background noise. But this is really good for our spine. I'll turn around and show you as well. So I'm stretching the spine. I can also strengthen the shoulders. <clears throat> I can also stretch. So we're just playing with different variations of hanging. Also, you can get your abs involved with the hanging. So this is just basic things, but just hang. Decompress your spine. All right, that was movement one, hang. Movement number two, squatting. So you want your feet about shoulders width apart. It could be wider, it could be more narrow. There's different variations for squatting. But you want to keep your spine as straight as you can. And simply go down into a deep squat. But we're not talking about repping out squats to build a big booty, but actually just long hold, deep squat resting position. This will really improve your digestion and just open up your hips a lot more. You can begin playing with it and twisting in it. You can reach up, both sides. You can reach it up this way. It's a little more hard. So yes, there's your squat. Next movement we need to practice is back bending. So there's a couple variations you can do just here where you just open up one side and we're reaching. Come back and do the other side. So like a half of a crab reach. Once this is nice and warm for you, you can even go into a full bridge back bend. which leads me to the next movement, inversion. Any movement where the heart is over the head begins to reverse the blood flow. This one is good for our shoulders, spine, back, hamstrings. You can throw in some push-ups there if you'd like. Another version is the headstand. So you can widen the legs here. Lower yourself down. You can just chill here. This is very good for the core and for the hair, for hair loss. If you're feeling confident, you can take it up, maybe against the wall or whatever have you, have a friend spot you. But headstand. And so we've just covered hanging, squatting, back bending, and inverting. That's pretty much the main foundation. If you do nothing else, this will keep your spine mobile, alive, young, and youthful. But they say you're only as young as your spine is flexible, so see you guys. <laughs> Cute. Ah, stop. So thanks guys for tuning in, and I hope you learned a lot and can utilize those movements that I just showed you for spinal health and daily mobility practice. Um, if you would like to maybe have a more personalized approach, maybe more difficult movements or easier variations, I offer personal one-on-one -on -one coaching. Um, so that's something that we can do over Zoom. And yeah, now if you're actually interested in the opportunity to meet up with me in person in Ecuador, in the tropics, uh, myself and Tropical Jeremiah are actually hosting a fruit nature and movement retreat uh, in the Andes Mountains of Ecuador this July. So um, that's coming up pretty soon. And if you guys wanna learn more about that opportunity, feel free to click the link below and you can read all about that. Um, yeah, uh, last but not least, yeah, have a beautiful day.
please click the like button, subscribe to my channel, and even click the notification button so you can see whenever I'm posting new content. And um, yeah, I hope you're having a beautiful, free, delicious day and full of movement, full of life, full of love. Get some sunlight, get some fresh air. Don't spend all day indoors like this. I just had to come in to, so you guys can hear me well. And yeah, peace, love, and blessings. Ciao.